Hey. You said sound happy. I am. <laughs> we're filming this out of order, yes. so we're sweaty and the day is long and it's yeah. been three days of work. Yes. Yeah, we're, we, a little, we're a little wiped out. We do have stuff to talk about though. Yeah. Lyme disease. Yes. Back problems. Yes. Life stuff. Yeah. Craziness and whatever's going on in the world. Nuts so. Yeah. But first, let's get to work. Hey guys, we have um, a sick cow. Yeah. Our milk cow honey had given birth to, Clover. I don't know, you probably can't see her. We'll show her later. Clover's out there. How long ago? In the end of March, so five months. And she's super thin. She keeps losing weight. Um, and a week or so ago, she uh, started milk, with diarrhea. Well, her milk first, it started with her milk, just. Yeah. It was practically nothing. All right. Let's then we stopped, goes. we cut her off stopped so that. milking, yep. And then we brought out uh, some friends of ours who are veterinarian, and they told us what to do. It's not fixed it. We brought a second veterinarian out, so we've had two vets out. We're doing what they're saying to right. do. Right. We're gonna up our game though today. Well, and here's the funny thing, okay? She is acting completely normal. She yeah. eats, she sleeps, she walks around no problem, she yeah. drinks plenty of water. Just um, super thin. Super thin, and then runny poo. So, um, and then, well, of course, we've dried her up, but, um, yeah, it's, yeah. I don't understand what's going on with this cow. She's been wormed, so she doesn't have worms. She's been eating DE. She eats DE. She has had chemical wormers. Um, she has been given probios, and that, yeah. I think, is one of the things that's helping this. turn the corner. Yeah. We, yeah. Um, we just started with that recently, mm -hmm. but I just want you to know that we're doing everything everybody's telling us, the yeah. experts, and this is just getting a little sketchy because yeah. we don't want the animal to be in pain at no. all. Well, and she doesn't seem like she's no. in pain. So I can't figure out what the, what's going on with this animal. So today what we're going to do is we're going to up the game mm -hmm. and we're going to give her more DE. We're going to, if she'll take it normal, we're going to try that. Try that. If not, we're going to mix it in with something sweet. Oh, also, we stopped giving her grain because I know that if, yeah. they, if they have too much grain, they which can get she poop. doesn't, they get acidosis. So that's not it. Um, and she's not lethargic. It's, you know, it's all of the things that... Um, indicators. The indicators are not, they're not lining up. It's very strange. Well, we'll show you here in a sec because yeah. she's probably waiting out there because she yeah. heard us come she up. She heard us calling. Um, so. But today it's going to be DE, and if you don't know what it is, we'll tell you in a sec. Mm -hmm. It's also going to be ProBios. We did cut the milk, or the, yeah, we, we dried her up. Just dried her up. And you're going to see fresh grass, different grass, the whole thing. Also hay. Yeah. So she's got all of the different things that would help her get better, and she's just not. I so. just, we're hoping and praying that yeah. this is not something weird. Oh, we did have her oh, tested yes. for... Um, the Yoni's disease, so we did that, that was that came back negative, and then also bovine leukemia, bovine cancer, came negative, back, and those both came back negative. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, ProBios is this gadget here. You can actually get it at a farm store, and what it is good for is it helps uh, put good bacteria back in your gut. It's in their gut. In their gut, yeah. It's kind of like yogurt. So, it's cow yogurt. Cow yogurt. Yeah, that's it's got live bacteria in here, um, and you can you can give it to beef, dairy, goats, and sheep, and it helps with getting them back, getting their 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 digestive system back in line. Ruminants. Yep. Okay. So here we go. That's that's not honey. <laughs> that's puzzle. Hi, puzzle. You've got Dottie over there. And she is healthy, healthy, healthy. But you can see, look at the difference. Showing some ribs on a Jersey cow, that's fine. That's actually normal. She is a healthy Jersey cow. This one's on the thin side. This one's honey here. Get, oh, you need some screen time? Is that what that is? I see. Oh, my lanta, bro. Come on. Don't bite me. 
So that one's honey there, and Chris is gonna bring out some stuff and we're gonna see what she'll take. And there's Coco. All right, now for honey, the vet said, go ahead and give her a shot of vitamin B. So that's next up. Okay, now this is diatomaceous earth. It's food grade diatomaceous diatomaceous earth. It's made of diatoms. Um, it's basically like crushed up the stuff that's the uh, coral reefs and things are made of. I think that's right. I can't remember. I'd have to go back and look. But it's food food grade. You can eat it. Watch. Now, I mean, it's on my hands. You can eat it. She just took that out of the cow's bucket that she eats out of. Look at this, Mom. Check this out. You know what I this know. is? Face of not caring. This is the face of not caring. I know. I want the cow to get better. Yeah. Uh, but just to show you guys that it is food grade, you can eat it, yeah. and it gets rid of parasites and things. Yep. It's uh, on a microscopic level. It's really, really tiny shards. Mm -hmm. uh, even though for us it feels like talcum powder, but on a microscopic level, it hooks onto those things and helps pass them through. So hopefully this will help too. She mixed yeah. it in with just a little bit just, of sweet. Yep, just one of these scoops of grain um, just to kind of mix it up. And so she wants it. So she'll want it, yeah. Okay, so the regiment is continuing. Mm -hmm. And if we find that there's something that we need to do that's different, we're gonna do it. Yep. But right now, this is what the veterinarians, plural, mm -hmm. have told us to do. Yep. So, I guess we're gonna keep after it daily and we'll keep you guys posted because, well, she's not just a dairy cow for us. No, she's not, she's not a tool. She's she's one of the family. She she's provides pet. for our family and, for and Grace. we will do, yep, we will do what we can to take care of her to the best of our ability. So. Yep. So I just got back from running some errands and I stopped at the post office and one of our awesome subscribers sent us something to organize our drill bits. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking about that. Yeah. And it's magnetic on the back, which I thought that was really cool because we can stick it on the front of the toolbox and it's not going anywhere. So. Well, and so problem solved. Yeah. Whoever you are, Thank you, you know so who you much. are. Thank you very much. Yes. But, okay. So it's another part of our of my errands today. But here, here's another thing, is that out there, which we're gonna go and yeah. see it in just a sec, we started putting the chicken fence together. Yes. And? So, got our, our Craftsman air compressor, right? Not air compressor, the uh, stapler. Air compressor stapler, whatever it's called, right? Got it out, got the staples in on the fence on the first post, went to use the second post, and Brad was doing great, and he's like, here, give me a hand, I'll pull the fence, you staple it. Me, right here. Broke it. Broke it. <laughs> and we don't know how. I broke it. No idea we how. Don't know how. I turned it upside down so that I could get the staples on the bottom. And something went wonky with the the thing in it's there, old. and it's and it is old. It's I mean it's probably 10, 12 years old, and we've used it maybe a dozen times in that time. And I okay. tried to pull it apart, yeah. and we're gonna probably get it repaired and right. then maybe gift it to a friend. Yeah. But since this is an opportunity, I broke it. it's an opportunity. I broke it. But you also <laughs> went and got. I went and got a, a cordless one. Yeah. Toyland. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Caleb's excited about this because <laughs> he can he can run this one easy. I can run this one. I'm yes. gonna run it first. Battery powered. Yes. Brutus is excited <laughs> about it. Nana's excited about it. All right. So this is how far we got the other day. We got the fence tied around the the corner there, and then it went around this corner, and then we're done. So. I don't know, Grace, what do you think? You ready? Yeah. Let's do this. You got this, babe? Oh, look at that. What? It shot out the side. Huh? Weird. Which is a good reason to not put your finger there. No. Don't put your finger there. It's a bad idea. Look at this. We got our gate up. We're recycling this because this was the, the calf pen, so we're going to reuse it right here. Now we just have to doll it up. It's and, done. And we did have a problem. Yeah, this is. A slight this problem. Is... No. There. He right broke there. my gate. He broke? Yes. You. 
You mean you by broke, I put it up broke. here and made it work? Because you used your foot. I made it work? Okay. You I didn't break it. anything. You did too. You can glue that on there. I made your door happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay, another thing that's going on is the barn is chugging along. Mm -hmm. Not as fast as I'd like. No, but, I mean, we have to work around schedules. and Other people's work schedules because, yeah. you know... We have them come over and they help out. We help mm -hmm. out there with them and yep. it's, everybody has their jobs. That's right. So That's right. working around stuff, but it's gonna be awesome. I mean, this wood is rough sawn. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be cool. Yeah. But it's just taking more time. It's yeah. going to get done before winter. Oh yeah, it'll get done before winter. Um, and and that's that's the goal I'm hoping for is that it gets done before winter. What? It'll get done before. Yeah. Yeah. Um, because last winter was a challenge. Scooping the snow away from the door and de-icing the track. And well, I did fix the door. Yes, he did. you did fix the door. I did fix the door, so it's not going to be nearly as hard, even if there is snow to dig away. Right. It'll be a lot easier to move. Yeah. yeah. Well, anyway, let's talk. Let's talk. Thank you, baby. You're welcome, honey. You are one cool drink of water. Yeah. So here's the scoop, guys. Uh, yeah, a lot of work getting done. It's like you're working against the clock mm -hmm. because winter is coming. Brutus is standing right there on Watching. the inside. And yeah. He's irritated that he's not out here with right. us. Yeah, he likes to be wherever we are. And he gets mad. And he well, barks. But, yeah. yeah, the clock is ticking. Mm -hmm. And it's not just the clock. It's that we're always racing against something, whether it's money. Mm -hmm. Only have a limited amount of money to get a project done. Right. And then prices go through the roof on, like, <laughs> say, lumber. Or tin. Tin. It's double. It's insane how much it costs. And we've got to save up our pennies. Mm -hmm. So, yep. Yep. yeah, we're working on it little by little. Um, oh, I know what I was going to tell you guys. The Thrive Life sale. Oh, my gracious. <laughs> it's huge. It's If you sign up for a monthly delivery, you get 30% off. It's actually more than that, though, well, really. Hold on, I'm not there yet. Sorry, I'll you shut up. You get 30% off of retail. Then if it's over, if your order is over a hundred dollars, you get free shipping, which is another percentage. I mean, it's it works out to be about forty-two percent off. All and in all, huge savings, huge savings, and and it's not just for customers. If you want to sign up to be a consultant, you can do that too, um, and get your monthly delivery set up, and you can still do that. By the way, just so you know, there's no fee to no. get set up on delivery at all. No. And if you decide you don't want to buy anything, don't buy anything. Don't buy anything, right. I will say, now is an unbelievably excellent time to jump in if you think you might even want to sell any at all, or if you might want to figure out ways to get a little bit more discount for yourself. Right. Even if you don't want to sell at all. Right, right. There are kits, guys, that are only 100 bucks. Right, and that's not a, an annual fee. That is one time only. Um, you pay the hundred dollars. And you're in. You're in. You're a consultant. And most of the kit that you get is, is food, food to it's, try out. Yeah, it's not like an entry fee and then you start buying. No. It's here's much food. Right. And you're in. Right. So it's it's an amazing deal. Out of all of the um uh businesses like this. Oh, it's not even close. This, this is, is far by far the best. By far the best deal yeah. that you can do. I love it. So that and for um <laughs> For our Patreon friends, the library that I promised you that I'm going to start posting stuff, it's going to be going up. It's just been taking me a little bit longer yeah. to get uh, books compiled for you to download. And also, if I have a voice at all tonight, because I have been recording at night because it's quiet in the it's house. quiet, yeah. If I have a voice tonight, there should be a new song up tomorrow. It's praise song. Uh, it's Psalms. Psalms. Awesome. Yeah. I think this one's Psalm 95. I'm pretty sure. That's no. Cool. Psalm 25. Okay. I think so. Yeah, I'm sure it's a Psalm of David. I'm sure. <laughs> I, I just forget. We're busy. It's... 
Right. I can't be expected to remember the songs I wrote. Oh my goodness. I know. Crazy. That's why you write them down. That is, a, that is why you write them That's down. That's why you record them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anyway, thank you guys so very much for being a part of our world. We are yeah. truly grateful. Yes. And you get to watch all of our craziness. And mistakes. Yes. Speaking of mistakes. No, don't do that. Have an amazing and blessed day.